Hi, this is Mommy Powers, and today I'm going to show you how to set up your ant farm gel colony by Uncle Milton. We received this, or my little guy received this, from Santa as a Christmas gift. Um, once you receive it, you open up the box. This is what it looks like right here. You can put batteries inside to light it up, or you can plug it in on that side with an ad adapter. And there's a card inside the box that allows you to order your ants. Our ants came in today. I don't know if you can see them. Here they are. There's approximately 30 ants in there. And they all appear to be alive. This is our second batch of ants. The first ones that were sent, uh, most of them were dead. So I had to reorder. And they just came in. So we'll set those aside for now. And I'm going to be reading from the Ant Farm Light Up Gel Colony instructions. It says to remove the habitat lid. And I removed it. It then says to uh, remove and discard the plastic wrap, which I did. Remove the habitat lid. Remove and discard plastic liner from inside habitat. I already did that. With the tunnel starter tool which came in the box, that's this right here. It says to make three holes in the gel, each about two inches deep and spaced equally apart. Swirl the tool a bit to enlarge the holes. So I will do that right now. Uh, these are their starter tunnels. So it may take them a while to get used to these because the gel is something that they aren't accustomed to. So they'll need a little time to get used to it. And then they'll go into these tunnels. And from these tunnels, they will make their own tunnels. You don't have to feed or water the ants. The gel supposedly has everything they need to survive. They eat it, I guess. We'll find out. I'll make this one a little bit deeper. can always go back and make the tunnels deeper and larger if they're not, if they don't seem to be working. Okay, I've already put the batteries in. It takes two AAA batteries. I put those in already. And let's see if you can see it. That's what it'll look like lit up. But we don't need that right now. Um, I've ordered my harvester ants. I got them today, as I already said. And now, it says you can expect to receive your ants in two to five weeks. I got mine in less than a week. And they'll send you a notice via email to let you know when they've shipped them. Uh, you can also stock your habitat with ants from your neighborhood. Instead of ordering the ants, it says look for large ants that cannot escape through the air holes. Um, okay. Remove habitat lid, carefully shake the ants in, and replace the lid. It says the ants may be less active right now since they just arrived. It says to carefully open the plastic tube of ants and gently shake or tap to allow the live ants to fall in. Try not to let any dead ants fall in. Be very careful not to touch the ants because they do bite. So, let's see if I can do this without getting bit. I kind of want to shake them all down to the bottom because I really don't want to be bit. I would suggest if this is something you do for your kids. Oh, there they come. Goodness. They are ready. Trying to shake them all out. Is that it? No. Oh, looks like there's one more in there. Come on out, buddy. Is he in there? He's walking the wrong way. 
I can't tell if there's a couple of dead ones in there. Oh, no, I don't think they're dead. They seem to be... Get in there. <laughs> I've never done this before. This is our first ant farm. Did he come out? Yeah, he came out. Okay. All ants are out. Nothing else in there. Let me put the lid back on before they escape. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, we have ants escaping. Get back in there. Okay, caught one. Get back in there. Oh, now they both came out. This isn't meant to be a comedy, but it might turn into one. Where's the other one? Okay, people, we are chasing ants in the kitchen. <laughs> Get in there. Okay, keep an eye on the other one. No, 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 no. I don't want him. He's probably getting very upset. Where's the other one? Okay, got one back in. Let's grab the other one. This is a comedy of errors here. Get back in. Okay, he's in. We have to make sure we have this lid on here. Very tight. I don't think it is yet. Maybe it's backwards. Okay lid may give you some problems like it's giving me. It's still not on. I guess I should have practiced with the, there it is, I should have practiced with the lid before I put the ants in here. So I would advise you to practice the lid, practice putting the lid back on. Because if you don't, you may have some escapees. The lid is on securely now. And it doesn't look like anybody will be escaping. So this is day one. I will um, watch them and I'll be back tomorrow to let you know how everything's going. Or if they start tunneling before that, I'll let you know. It looks like they're all checking out the gel right now. Let's see what they look like with the light. Pretty cool. Looks like one might already be in the gel. Yeah, I think right, right here, looks like one's already in the gel. Okay, this is Mommy Powers signing off. Thank you.